you doing today? I am your host, Rich, here on behalf of Rich TV Live with our very special guest, the chairman of Fury Gold Mines, symbol F-U-R-Y on the Toronto Stock Exchange and the New York Stock Exchange, Ivan Bebek. How are you doing today, Ivan? Doing very well, thank you. Thank you for joining us. Very excited for you to be here with us today. Uh, very excited about learning more about your company. And I have a few questions for you. First and foremost, Fury Gold Mines is a gold exploration company that is positioned in three prolific mining regions in Canada. Can you tell us a little bit more about the company and your high grade assets as well a little bit about your experience? Great, thank you. Um, great to be here. I, I've been doing this for 21 years and I've been a gold bug that whole time. And my goal in my, since I've entered the business was to go and find some of the biggest gold discoveries in the world. And I feel Fury offers that opportunity in three different places. And it's it's something, it's the best thing I've been part of on the gold side. I've had some tremendous successes. Uh, the first company our group created was called Keegan Resources, went from 49 cents to $9 per share, $5 million market cap to about a billion dollar market cap in a period of about four years. And, uh, and and that's the kind of returns, and that's why I'm a gold bug, because we're looking for those share price returns. We followed that with a company called Caden, where we drilled 100 holes in Mexico in the bear market, and we came up with a, an asset sale. We sold the company. It was 67 cents the year before we sold it. We sold it for 350 a share to Agnico Eagle. And if you hold the shares of Agnico for 14 months after that transaction, they would have traded around $10 per share. So this is the kind of returns we're chasing, and, and that's why we're looking for gold in Canada. Canada is the, the, the best jurisdiction as far as I'm concerned. We can raise all our money at 40 or 80 percent above our spot price because of mechanism the government allows us to do it. And we've got some of the best assets. We've got two assets, Homestake Ridge in BC, million ounces of about seven and a half grams gold, which is really high grade. And one of the most prolific regions where some of the largest gold mines in the world have been found, such as SK Creek. Um, we believe that this is highly underexplored and there's a lot of room for it to get bigger. And we're about to show that to the world here in the coming weeks. Eau Claire is in Quebec, number one place globally. You get to raise money at 80%. There's a million ounces of gold that a company drilled in one spot for 25 years. And that's running about eight grams per ton. Again, extremely high grade. And when I say high grade, I'm talking about profitability and appeal for investor price share price performance, right? In that deposit, they never stepped away from the million ounces of high grade. And we just did that two weeks ago. And we see this incredible expansion on basically day one on the first hole out of a massive drill program we just started. And thirdly, Committee Bay, this project here is a huge gold greenstone belt. It's a it's a it's a piece of land up in the Arctic. It's it's a belt because there's a certain type of rocks that have a lot of gold endowment, 300 kilometers long. And we've sampled the entire 300 kilometers. We've spent $60 million in the last five years getting closer to discovery up there. There's a bit of cover on it, so you need to add a bit of science. We've used cool things such as artificial intelligence and so on, but the team we have backing us is really the secret weapon. They're all former Newmont global experts. Newmont's the largest mining company in the world, gold mining company in the world. And these guys have put together this portfolio. So. When I talk about Fury and when I think about Fury, when you think about Fury, you have to think really big and not just because we're going to find big mines, but we're going to try to gener generate those share price returns for investors because the second phase of a success that we're going to try to create is going to be to, to buy producing mines and actually turn our mines from explorers into producers. And we've put a CEO in place, Michael Timmons, who comes from Agnico Eagle, amazing guy. I met him when they were buying our last company and he's leading that charge. And he was at Agnico Eagle when they went from one mine to nine mines in a 15 year period, that was wow. an extreme growth. Agnico went to hundred dollars per share. And so that's, that's kind of the, the, th the thought behind Fury, where we're coming from, the capabilities are really strong and the portfolio is awesome. And, and all three projects are in a very mature stage of massive discoveries that could be made here in the coming months. Now you mentioned three projects, which project are you the most excited about and why? Oh. That's like asking me which is my favorite child if I have three <laughs> children, and I have two, and, and I couldn't tell you I love them both equally. Um, I love Committee Bay for the scale. It, it, it is actually a gold bug or a gold explorer's dream. If you can make a few, a few 10 million ounce discoveries you know, up in that part of the world, it would be incredible. However, um, Eau Claire is, is starting to show us a lot more potential away from the deposit that we're going to make bigger this year. And that's what's really got my attention as of lately. Um, big land position, gold everywhere. The group before never ever, you know, gave it the proper exploration to go see if it's there. 
it's in a part of Quebec where some of the largest gold mines in Canada occur. And we have about seven targets that we see that we'll get into this summer that could possibly compete with that committee bay kind of huge scale opportunity. And then the third one, Homestake Ridge, um, it's something that we've explored for a few years. Just turn the corner on it. You'll see in the coming weeks, it has a chance now to compete with the other two. So committee bay is my first, but the other two are close behind. The company has multiple drill programs scheduled throughout the year. Can you talk a little bit about your plans for advancing your entire portfolio of assets in 2021? Sure. Um, drilling is the number one way to perform as a share price. And that's the only way we're going to get rich as investors. And so we're going to do probably well over 100,000 meters of drilling in the next 18 months. About 80 to 100,000 meters of that will be this year alone. The drill is, there's two drills turning as I'm talking to you today. Hmm. That, is, that is the way we're going to advance our projects. Before we say development, before we talk about building mines, you have to know how big they are. And the first two that have really advanced assets that could be mines today, according to some economic studies we've put out, these ones actually are, are looking like they could get double or triple the size. You, you would, it would be the big miss to build the mine before you know how big it is because you have to know how big of a plant to build, right? So from us, you're going to get drill results every month for the next 18 months. Every month, we're going to provide a lottery ticket type of a drill hole that may or may not give us that lottery type of return. And every month right now, I know categorically after the first drill results came out of Eau Claire, that Eau Claire is going to get bigger. We're going to go into a bull market with our first gold asset that we're drilling getting bigger every month for the next 12 months. Wow, that's impressive. A lottery drill program. That's interesting. Never heard that before. I like that. What differentiates Fury Gold Mines from other Canadian-based gold producers and explorers? Great question. And um, a lot of people will be critical towards it because we've broken the mold. And what we're doing, it's a very big company way of thinking like a major. We're putting together a pipeline, three projects that could all give us a home run for different reasons or the same reasons in terms of discovery. As I mentioned that, that lottery ticket kind of drill hole each month, we will provide that possibility for shareholders month after month for a very long period of time across all three projects. The biggest differentiator behind us outside of a a very established branded reputation as a group since 2005 for the last 15 years and the fact that we found a mine and built a mine previously it's the caliber of our technical team and the aggressive nature of our exploration programs we're taking um, if you have a very good technical team in terms of the geoscientists that work for you you can take bigger swings and we're not shy we we are bold we are we are ready to go out and take those huge swings because you don't get paid well and our business plan doesn't work and you don't make money as a shareholder if you're conservative and drill safe holes. You make money for drilling the holes that are a kilometer away from your deposit or, or going after brand new discoveries. And that's really what, what differentiates us. We're more aggressive than all of our peers and we have different capabilities. And lastly, we cannot just find it. We actually have people in place that could build the mines that we're going after, which will provide a big premium on anything we make as a discovery going forward. Now you mentioned on it, a little bit about your leadership. Fury's leadership has a track record of success, starting with yourself, many, many, 20, over 20 years of experience in this industry. What, who are your key members and what experience do they bring to the table? Great question, touched on them a little bit. Mike Timmins, the CEO that we brought in and uh, he was drawn in by the assets that we have. Came from Agnico Eagle, was a superstar on the corporate development side. He was building their first mine and then he was in Corp Dev acquiring the additional nine mines they had that made Agnico what it was today. So he has the training and the background by, I'd argue, the most profitable gold company in the world. It trades at $90 a share. I mean, that kind of understanding of how to create that value in the share price by somebody that can actually build mines is rare. That's the first guy. Michael Henriksen, our SVP exploration, he was a global structural geologist for Newmont. Him and his colleagues were drilling a mine called the Hoffo in Ghana. It was about 8 million ounces. His team, you know, was challenged to see if they could make it bigger or if Newmont would sell that deposit. It grew to 25, 30 million ounces under his watch. And so he's a legendary mine finder. He was called the gold ninja when he was at Newmont, which is really great. But the smartest thing about Michael Henriksen, the SVP exploration is he's smart enough to surround himself with different world experts with different science backgrounds that complement what he knows versus try to do it all himself. And the third person that, that makes this happen is our uh, CFO, uh, Lindsay. She's, she's Lindsay Sherry. She's amazing because she comes from Goldcore, 
Gold Corp was the largest gold company in the world. And she was there out there being the controller and she was there through the financial growth. So we have the ability to grow quickly, to grow large and to perform without any hiccups along the way. The mentality is think big, start small and think big. And when I say start small, I mean, start where we are now with a really good package of assets, think really big of what it can become and have the team to go execute behind it to make it happen. And then just on my record, I've raised close to a billion dollars in the companies I've been involved in. They've all been successful to date. And so, you know, for me, it's how can we do things better over a period of 20 years? The formula is really good. The team's really strong and the opportunity has never been better aligned with the gold market that's in front of us. Now, Rich TV Live is simulcasting in countries all over the world. We're well over 90 countries. I always want to remind everyone that Rich TV Live is strictly for education and entertainment purposes. Always do your due diligence. Always do your research before you invest in anything that we talk about and discuss in our show. If you guys like the video, please smash the like button, comment on the video, share the video everywhere, and subscribe. I really like this company, in my opinion, just learning from you directly and doing a little bit of research, it seems to me like it has incredible future. Now, what should special uh, interest be focused on by investors? If an investor had to look at one specific thing or a few key catalysts over the next couple months, what would they be? Drill results every month for the next 18 months. Drill results that could make each mine or deposit much bigger or make that world-class discovery. The fact that we offer that Every month there'll be drill results out of this company. And, and that's that's the most unique thing about it because of how much drilling is gonna happen and how, how long we're gonna be able to offer that kind of huge return. So it's probably one of the most catalyst driven gold companies, exploration companies that I know of globally right now. So that's what I'd focus on, absolutely. And our investors love to get in contact with companies. A lot of times there's other companies, other gold companies that are going to see these videos that might be wanting to get in contact with you as well. What's the best way for potential joint venture partners, investors, shareholders to get in contact with you, Ivan? I would say our website, www.furygoldmines.com. Our email address is info at furygoldmines.com, I-N-F-O at F-U-R-Y-G-O-L-D-M-I-N-E-S.com. And I'm quite active on LinkedIn personally. And if anybody has a question and wants to reach out to me directly, Ivan Bebek on LinkedIn, uh, please reach out. And, and I do add a lot of commentary along the way with a lot of our catalysts as they go forward. And so look forward to hearing from anybody that wants to know more. That's fantastic. Well, thank you so much for joining us today. The chairman of Fury Gold Mines, symbol F-U-R-Y in Canada and the United States, Ivan Bebek. Thank you for joining us today. Thank you for having me. Great pleasure. My pleasure. Thank you for watching. If you guys are not winning, you're not watching. This is Rich from Rich to be Live with Ivan Bebek, the chairman of Fury Gold Mines. Have a nice day.